with all this NFL experience, but Cliff Kingsbury, a dude who was not good in college, um, pretty much backdoored his way into a job in Arizona that he didn't really earn or deserve after pretty much screwing over USC, which, by the way, they just announced their new athletic director today. He's probably going to have to hire Urban Meyer. Excuse me. Oof. But, yeah. Anyway, whatever. Um, you good? Yeah, I'm sorry. I know I went on a good rant today. It's just, That's cool. yeah, it's just, it was, it's, it's just frustrating. And I wish, I just wish y'all would stop. Just stop, stop. I hate to stop break. stealing, stop stealing our stuff. Just own it that y'all are not original and y'all can't come up with original things. It's okay. Appreciate it, but don't appropriate it. Don't steal and pretend it's yours. That's it. That's kind of what they did in slavery. So I don't know. I don't see it. stop. Just, it just stop. Sadly. Just stop. I agree though. Maybe one. y'all want to tell us to teach us some new shit. Learn this. Stop. I think they're just mad because black people refuse to put raisins in our potato salad. Oh, we're just Lord. not. I do not want to the... culturally gentrify. I'm not going to accept that. I'm not putting raisins in my fucking. Side potato note, salad. but in potato salad, you know what's a um good in potato salad? Apples. Yeah, I know. I'm Koreans no ra- no no so for real. Korean, if you guys taste the Korean, Korean potato salad, potato salad they fire. have apples in their potato it's salad. It's really cold. Yes. And it's actual potato salad. That's where I got the apple from. Because I worked Korean at an Asian barbecue. restaurant. Yeah, I worked at an Asian no, restaurant. No, I would not. I would not. Mm-mm, mm-mm. I was like, is this the apple? That's bomb. But no, I would not do a raisin. That's that's some cruel. I wouldn't white do apple shit. either, but I will definitely partake in some Asian themed potato salad because that shit fire. Yeah, no, and I, it's a little bit spicy sometimes. So it depends on where you go. But the Korean barbecue that I usually go to, they have apple like little bits of apple in there, and when you eat it, you're just like, mm, this is I, actually good. This is actually good. But not raisins and potato salad. No, no, that's why. Or you know, or cauliflower. That's why we salad. can't trust y'all. A cauliflower disguised as chicken wings. You get fucking stabbed. Don't play with me. Anyway, um, I don't really have much of a rant other than man, this is the hundred and fiftieth episode and who'd have thunk it Pete wouldn't be here. Wow. I'm kinda shocked. It's weird. This podcast is, is turning into something else. But it, that's the exciting part. But speaking of which, um yeah, serve. So are you are you a podcast plan or not? I told you. I'm not a fed. Why you got a dossier? Work. Why you got a dossier on us? Um, why, why you got a file on me and Pete? What you mean? What you mean? What you mean? Elaborate. Okay. So you be having your notebook, mm-hmm. and you still have not told Pete and I whatever was in the notebook. And when you started with us, we we're like, "Hey, just take notes every week. Let us know what you see." You still haven't said anything. Yeah. And then also, you made a couple jokes. Yeah, I saw what you said on the on our recent you know post the other day, and I was like, hmm. No, I'm not a plant. a plant. I'm not a podcast plant. I can't let you see. I can't let you see my notes because if I open my notes and let you see my notes, then I feel like it's just. It's what it's just like not ruined, but then like you guys get a taste of it, then it's like it's, the surprise is ruined. When does the surprise like? When would you be unveiling said surprise? Are you going to wait till our tailgate on November 23rd? Yeah. No, no, USC, no. UCLA tailgate? No. You're going to blow us out of the water then? No. You're going to get us out of here? No. Are you going to get are you going to no. cancel us? No. No, never. I don't I don't know. I, uh, I I'm just curious. I got questions. What do you think these notes? What do you think are in these notes? That's my question. Like I, that's the interesting thing. I don't know what's Do in them. Do you think I have so something I that's of, conspiring against y'all? Oh no, please. I, I could can't. I could think of three different things this oh, week no. I've done that would probably get me canceled. But that's neither no, here nor there. No. But you can't really cancel anybody. I mean, Ray J's not going anywhere, so you can't cancel Ray J. So, I mean. but again, um, yeah, I just want to say. I hope Pete's out partying his ass off in Oakland, enjoying that Raiders victory. He's probably gonna have a bunch of shit to say. He's like, you're not even a real Raiders fan, but you know you are, bro. Come back to the dark side, bro. And Bruce would be like, man, we didn't want your ass. And I'm like, look, man, it's complicated. It's like when if you, it's like if I just kept going back to that that one like X, like when we're together, volatile shit happens, but it's fun. But we know we're no good for each other. It's kind of like that. Being a Raiders fan. And it's like, 
I was like, you know what? Hmm. When I saw they're up like 2017, I was like, oh shit, they're winning. Good. It's the Chargers. But best believe I'm talking mad shit to all the Chargers fans who be on my timeline uh, trying to trash me. They was trashing me all last year. Oh, the Raiders didn't win. Well, guess what? The Cal State, Dominguez Hills, Carson, Colt, Chargers um, couldn't beat Oakland. So there you go. Voila. All that talk about uh, Joey Bosa and Melvin Ingram. And a rookie played better than both of them. So there's that. But anyway, it's a touchdown to 10, 150th episode. If you feel like, you know what? Wow, I'm never going to listen to the show like with with just KB and not Pete. Because with KB, it's trash. Um, Cool, that's good for you. Uh, it's not true, though. But if you're like, you know what, this is actually a nice changeup because you didn't, fi- you felt like nobody got the throat ripped out on the air. Uh, don't worry, we do that in a group chat. It's all the time. All the time. For no reason. Mostly like Pete and Serve have been going at it lately. Which- yeah, because Pete want to roast on my, uh, on my phone because I know I have a bootleg phone and he want to talk about, oh, it's all pixelated because he got an iPhone that got the new damn iPhone. You're a hater, Pete. You're a hater. I was trying to do work. And show, look, I'm taking, I'm capturing moments of the podcast, and you know what? He want to complain and talk there about was some, there was some pixelation and you know coloration in the stance area. Okay, I will. Well, you know what? I'm in a better place now. So once I upgrade, some out. so once I upgrade on y'all, it's cool. I got the G7, and I still get shit talked about. You me. know what? Because I, I could have got the G10, or I could have got an iPhone. I literally could have yeah. switched years ago, but I just refused to do it because you know. Apple's the feds. Yeah. So and you want, you think, you think I'm an op. You might be an op. I don't know. You think I'm an op. You be an op. But, but P is the one with the Apple phone and you talk about Apple's the feds. But oh, I, no. P, P knowingly will sell us out ahead of time. We, we, we this was discussed y'all already. Y'all really think I'm going to sell y'all out? No. Y'all no. really think I'm conspiring against y'all? Nah, you might be conspiring within between the two of us. And I'm just like, huh, yeah. I was just going to go. And you did bring brownies. So I was yes. just like, part of your plan? I don't know. Well, you're getting taxed. If I find you're out, if I find out you're brownies. a mole from Ladies Night, I'm going to be really mad. By the way, shout out to Ladies Night. They're on tomorrow. No, I mean, they are dope. Shout out, shout out, ladies. But no, I am. You should me. definitely be a guest on Ladies Night. You should try it out one day. Just if know you guys you, want me you on will there, leave there drunk. I'm just if you guys want, I like I like drinks. That, that, I like drinks. That, that is true, Sam. But so anyway. if you ladies want me and you're interested on in my stoner little rants, then uh, I'm down. Yeah, but anyway, touchdowns and tangents. This was fun. It just seems like we're not having fun, but it was fun. Yeah, yeah. And I'm gonna enjoy one time. of those brownies off the air. So yeah. Y'all have a great one. Stay safe and uh, stop stop going to Popeyes. Just and stop it. No, keep going to Popeyes. Tell me how it is. Maybe I am an op. But I want to try the Popeyes. I mean, you can't let. <laughs> you don't want people to eat chicken. You're just going to restrain people from eating chicken. Pootie Tang and the Boondocks told us this would happen. <laughs> and I'm going to end the show on that note. Just for that, I think I'm probably going to get a chicken sandwich from Wendy's. That don't count. Wendy's ain't shit. But I can't go to Popeye's. You don't want me to yeah, go to Popeye's. Yeah, you should go to Popeye's because then you're going to become a zombie. 